Hello! So we are back again with The Walking Dead video game season 1. Let's continue with episode 3, Long Road Ahead. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. Oh, I remember no Larry. Trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead. Somebody help me! Oh. Come on. We know this. That was a great scene. No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. I we regret nothing. Don't worry, little girl. Bandit's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I think that was Jolene, right? I think I shot her, actually. It's kind of been a while since we played the last episode. But it's all coming back to me now, especially with that uh, recap there. National Guard orders evacuation. Oh yeah, so last we left off, uh, we ended up in a new town? Small Town, USA. Episode 3, Long Road Ahead. Looks like this is our lucky day. Maybe. I don't like it. I don't like it. Keep your eyes open, alright? Just trying to be optimistic. Let's just get inside. The writer for this season is uh, really good. Mm, I just noticed I have uh, Lee's haircut. Oh, man. Lee, where do you come down on staying or going? You mean packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Mm. Yeah, we've been talking about it, but stay or you go. made up your mind yet? Uh, did go? We should go. Motels run its course, and it's not safe. You're damn right it has. We pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water. And if Lily's dead set on staying, then, well, that's the way it goes. Directed by Eric Parsons. Okay, just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Wait, wait, wait. This is... Oh, we're back at the old town? Oh, okay. Wait, let me think about this. Yeah, right, because his name is Lee Everett. So we're back at the old town. Yeah. This is your your dad's pharmacy. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. A barrel. Hey. Yeah. I'm coming up. Wait, no, wait. I'm not coming up. Think we'll find anything left? Think we'll find anything? Ain't much left in there. We'll see. Station wagon stuff's not gonna last as long as we thought. If we'd hit the road like I suggested, we wouldn't be in this situation. Still sore? Still sore? I took a bullet to the gut. What do you think? Maybe you should have stayed behind. I'll be alright. I'm coming up. Ladder's right there. Oh, so snippy. 
<clears throat> I broke it. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Better get a move on. Better find a trampoline. Let's check this jeep here. Mm. Oh, this is like that tractor scene all over again. Oh, there's something going on here. Front? Hmm. Looks like it still works. Oh? Lily's not doing so good, huh? Well, we killed her dad. Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. I don't really care for Lydia, Lily anyway. She has a bad attitude, just like her dad. I'm going to drink some Jesus juice. Usually I prefer Franzia, but ugh, so bitter. Let's play this Walking Dead game that's currently more engaging than the season 7 of Walking Dead. Fear the Walking Dead currently is doing really good. Oh. Oh wait, 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 wait. Can I still push this thing? Hmm. Hmm. Entry. The girl still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon? Uh, I think she understands. I think she understands. She's smart. Oh, so. Not like we had much choice. Right. Tell me about it, sister. Okay, now we use our lower extremities. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. What really? guy? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. What guy? He'll get over it. He'll get over it. Herschel's son is one of how many now? We've all seen a lot worse. He's a tough kid, you know. Like I said, not much phases him, but it's starting to add up. Farm, the dairy. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. Oh. Because I chose to save Duck over Herschel's son, right? You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Yeah, never mind the internal bleeding. Oh, shit. oh, you made some noise. You know what that means. Zombie time. Or not. Nice one. What the hell happened? What the hell happened? Thought you said thought you, you could, could handle, handle it. it. God, you ever been shot before? I'm sorry. Christ, you think you'd... Ah! He's hysterical. Oh God. Oh God. What, the, what the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? I just was gonna say I that. So. Walkers don't scream. Okay. Get ready. It's a girl, we have to help. It's a girl, she's gonna get us killed. It doesn't matter, we must keep moving. Uh keep moving? It doesn't matter. We gotta keep moving. Let's just leave her. Let's think about this. Oh well, she's bitten now. We gotta shoot her. Put her, Put her out, out of her misery. The gunshot, we leave idiot. Alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Yeah. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Good point. I'm gonna do what Kenny says. No! 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 Uh, leave her. I mean, look at her. She's clearly nuts anyway. She would have posed a problem for the crew. Hmm, 
She has a limited vocabulary. You listen, Lee. You listen to her screaming and dying. And you enjoy it. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Yes, Don't sir. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Okay, what do we got? Uh, take it. This... This thing... Food? A medicine bottle. Energy bar, good. This... This is easy. I'm just clicking on things. Oh. She's gone. There's not much time now. Uh, whatever this is. Oh, it's like Christmas. Or like a kid in a candy store. Time's running out. How much can I grab? Baby food. Oh, oh, whoa. Oh. Ah, oh. ah, I got it. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Come on, Lee! Up and over. Sorry, I keep saying that. We're still clear. Tussle! Jimmy! Yes! Uh, QQ, QQ is shit on this again. Ah, oh, crap. Ah! Forgot about that quick time stuff. Ah, oh, oh, shit. Ah, oh, I took too long. I took too long drinking my Jesus juice. Okay, I'm ready. We're still clear. Let's hustle. Q. Q, 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 Q. And E, right? I'm gonna break my keyboard. E. There's a Freak. sign on the door, the door that, that says, uh, Alive Inside. It's like a TV show. Out. Let's fucking get out! Fucking shit. Let's fucking get out. Yeah. What do I do? Again. Again. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Bingo, bango. That's a cool zombie. Ooh. That could be the thumbnail for Let's this go, video. Pal. Call me pal. We're besties. Beasties. The beasties boys. Oh man. Hot. I should just probably take my shirt off, but I won't. Oh. I tend to sweat when I drink. Clementine on her walkie talkie. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find Look, you I got there. a gun. She looks very innocent in this game. In the recent game, I saw um, that she has like a permanent scowl. Clementine? Looks like we yeah. got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. Yeah, I guess you should put that sign up. So, what did you get? Uh, nothing. Nothing. Didn't get anything. <laughs> Lee must have thumped his head out there or something. We got lots. Take a look. Oh, I'm just gonna be We're a fine a bitch to her. Nice work. Or like her. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. He's piling into an RV with you two after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall. Uh, we do whatever's best for That's the not kids. Graffiti. Those are bullet holes. Uh, and we got yeah, enough arrow right? shafts sticking first. out of it to dry our laundry. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly? See, I like that lady. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. 
Somebody needs to make Stop executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. Lily Kinney's got some legit points here. I'm so tired of it being you two versus Damn me. Damn it. I'm not on anyone's no. side, Lily. She's one These of them. decisions affect everyone. Work as what a about group. The food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you know What about it. medicine? Uh, we'll we deal, deal with, with it? shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? Yeah. What then? You just going to deal with that? Everything that bandits, happens to man. us is another excuse for you to More dangerous than the zombies. About leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of well, not hearing gonna... it. Do you know there how no we got in this world anymore. We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like <sighs> what? Like bait? We got what we needed. She was dead anyway. What is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. The you world has believe changed. the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon oh. and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! Whoa, whoa okay, damn. What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. We should just kill her and eat her. Cook her. Happy Kenny. Happy Kenny. My family's alive and that RV is running. You goddamn right I am. Everyone is under great stress. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. Time to talk. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Is that Carly? Well, right, I she's think cool. you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. She just seems the most Probably reasonable. Probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying Probably about because she's supplies. Very educated, With right? She's a reporter. The way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Ooh, relationship time with the white girl. Jungle fever. Oh, she gave him like a, like a wink, wink look. But she didn't wink. But it was like a wink without winking. You know what I mean? Let's talk to Lily again. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Hmm. You have to chill out, man. You have to chill out. You think? I'm not going to play the victim, but you and your buddy might have had a hand in my instability. Can I do anything for you? Haven't you... No. Yes. Yes. I could use your help. If There's you know what I mean. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. Oh. It's interesting. Paranoia isn't gonna help Paranoia us. Paranoia isn't gonna help us. I know what this sounds like, but I'm not paranoid. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. Oh, I'll What's poke around all right. I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you're using it when you shouldn't. You're just... Seems like you're manufacturing this from nothing. Prove me wrong. 
or I'll just assume it was you. What the hell? Oh, maybe, it, A maybe. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. All of that can shit. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, <laughs> your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. You can help. Don't tell anyone. You can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. Trouble. Secrecy. Did you hear what I just said? I won't <laughs> tell a soul. The part about not helping? You can't help. I will live in the shadows. Like Lee. He's a great character to uh, play as. Who is taking the our supplies? What if it's Lily? You know? It's like when you um, fart in your workplace, and then you say, hmm, who farted? Because if you say it, it's like you didn't do it. Uh, not that I've done that. Meaning that I've done that. Actually, at work when I fart, I just tell people, hey, I'm going to fart. I'm going to walk around a couple of feet this way, around the corner. I'm going to do it just to let you know. And they appreciate it. Just be honest with people, man. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the new it's world. It's the way it's gotta be. Yep. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Kinda horny. You guys trust everyone here? You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but... I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. Ooh, broken flashlight. What's up with that? Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. About the guns. About the guns. Don't you start. <clears throat> I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. Try harder with Lily. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. I'll talk to you later. Let's talk to our... future girlfriend? Talk to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment, too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Hmm. I think about you, too. I think about you, too. Our group is small. You're small. Good one, Lee. Not that I'm You're small. A convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those this two is things. Not how I thought this was gonna go. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. I would. You're probably I don't care. Right. Of course, it's I'm probably right. It's freaking zombie apocalypse. People might be pissed, and telling tell them people. might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? It'll be difficult, but I'll, I'll tell them. I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Don't 
call me small. <laughs> Don't call no, me small is there either. Anything else you want to talk about? You think people are ready to hear about me? Do you feel safe here? Do you know anything about this flashlight? Yeah. What about this flashlight, yo? Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. Hmm. Oh no, she's acting weird. She didn't do it, did she? I like her. But I'll be very upset if she is the culprit. Uh, do you feel safe here? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor in a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. Oh, well, I'm drinking I don't know. This place is Burgundy. fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Do you have any thoughts about Lele? I like these faces she's making. Although we're not even talking at the moment. Hmm. 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 Hmm? Hmm? You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. Yes, they There's should. never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now, it doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Okay, well, I guess now we tell people. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. I need to tell you something. Yeah. Fair. I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. I was going to prison the day I met you. I killed someone before once. I met you and before the plague, I killed somebody. Oh, so that's what... Yeah, that's it. It was a bad thing and there's no explaining it. <laughs> nice. Why are you telling me? Because I didn't want to keep it to myself anymore. Do you have any questions? You can go on back to your things. See, so you might think that I'm just playing whatever, like I don't care, I'm just choosing the most funniest um, choices, but actually, I would have done that. Like, I would have been honest and just tell people, or start to tell people, look, I did this thing, I killed somebody, sorry. Because like, it doesn't matter now, it's the zombie apocalypse, it's, there's no harm in just being honest nowadays. The world is so different, oh, well, these days, not nowadays. Well, actually, if everyone was honest like that nowadays, Hmm. I think the world would be a better place. Ain't gonna happen. But in this case, I can see this happening. Everyone just being honest suddenly because, hey, 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 ain't no law here. It's a lawless world. This is who I am. Who are you? We'd get along a lot better if we were just more honest and less scared. But then again, that's like... That kind of society is either non-existent or... Centuries ahead of us. Hi, guys. Mm, Kenny, you got a second? Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? This'll be... This'll be rich. It's serious. Oh, no. What'd the Kinda. she devil do to you? Shut up, man. I killed someone. Okay. I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's. Different from everything. This was before the walkers. Uh... I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and, you know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, right? Yeah, I did. And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess has got us doing now, Lee. Shit. Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course. Then shut it. 
You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. Ah. Uh, Kenny's right. Kenny is right. He's like the perfect survivor in this uh, world, this new world. Let's tell, um... Kacha? Kacha? Gacha? Katjaja. Can I talk for you for a Can second? Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? I've killed. I've killed before. I mean, before the walkers showed up. You mean you were a murderer? You say that like it was my job. Well, what are the details? It was in a dispute. Would he have killed you? No. I don't know. Probably not. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. Okay. I held Lily back, and Kenny made sure Larry didn't get up. What did he do? You don't know? He smashed his head in. <gasps> she didn't know. He didn't tell her. Oh, well, that's that then. Have fun gotcha. with all that. Everything keeps changing. <laughs>